Good morning, everybody. Today is going to be a Saturday in our life vlog. Um, yeah, Saturday is the day that Zach has Arabic class. I'm co-leading a trauma healing small group. Um, I also do some freelance work on Saturdays to edit photos or do some writing or um, just development of whatever projects I'm working on at the moment. So today is probably going to be an actual pretty good representation of what a day in a life is for us and if something unexpected happens it'll probably be a more accurate day in the life video than I could have planned for so either way I think we're good and I think it'll be really fun to show you guys um, a little bit of what our house is like uh, what our life is like what we actually do on a day-to-day -day basis um, not just what comes up on Instagram or Facebook but what everything looks like behind the scenes So every morning we eat breakfast together out on our balcony and then we read together. Um, Zach picked up this book recently and we've been reading it for the last few weeks. It's called Time of White Horses. And it's really good. It's about Palestine. I mean, it takes place in Palestine and it talks a lot about Palestinian culture. So we start off every morning reading together, eating breakfast together, drinking coffee and talking about philosophy, politics, religion, and all those fun things. <laughs> we really love it. I'm really glad Zach uh, recommended us doing that together.
So I did the cleaning that I have to do around the house. I did some freelance work. I did some writing, editing, prep work for New Hope. And I think I'm about to head on my way over there. I have some printing to do before everyone gets there. Um, and I have a little meeting beforehand. So I'm gonna be working on that. So I guess I'm just gonna pack up and take you guys on out with me. And you can see how transportation works in Egypt our uh, electricity went out. So I guess this part will kind of be in the dark. Normally I try to take the bus as often as I can or Uber's not crazy expensive in dollars here, but it's a bit expensive if you're living on the Egyptian pound. But guys, it's 103 degrees today. 103 degrees. I've been working all morning and it's gonna be a long day, so we're taking an Uber. So I'm outside uh, waiting for the Uber and he went to the wrong location, nearby but wrong location. And I tried to tell him to come, you know, the next street over, it's where I'm at. And he canceled on me. So, no, not a huge deal, but now I'm waiting on another five minute Uber. And the thing about transportation is if you can figure out how to use the local transportation, the public transportation like Metro and bus, it's gonna be actually more reliable than Uber. Uber's way more expensive and the drivers usually don't really know where they're going. So you're gonna have to give them directions. And trying to get them to show up to the right location also is complicated. So ironically, as I was saying earlier, if something didn't go according to plan today, it would be a more accurate day in the life vlog. So here we are. Um, our electricity went out earlier and it's 103 degrees today and I had been working all morning so I was tired and it's going to be a long day so I ordered an Uber, like I said. And then the Uber came but he went to the wrong street and I told him to meet me on my street so he cancelled after I had been waiting for like six minutes. And then um, ordered another one, after six minutes he came, drove right past me and cancelled and then now I'm on the third Uber and he was gonna be eight minutes away, eight to 10 minutes away. So I thought I'll go back inside cause it's 103 degrees outside. And I was walking into my building and someone dumped wa water, I hope, down the stairwell. So then whatever they dumped was on me. So here's a day in the life in Cairo. But there's a cute bunny outside, so that's nice. Good evening, everybody. I just made it home. It was a really long day. Uh, vlogged all morning, headed out to our New Hope Trauma Healing Small Group. It was a great time. Uh, finally made it out on the third Uber. So that was great. Um, 
It was not water that fell on my head in the stairwell, but I think it was just cleaning chemicals. So, you know, not too bad. Um, yeah, New Hope was great. I really enjoyed it. Tonight's topics and everything were fun. And I headed out to Maidi with a couple of friends. We had a birthday party slash farewell party for a friend of mine moving back to the States. So that's always sad. Um, people move here and move back quite often. That's kind of a part of the Cairo lifestyle, but never easy to say goodbye to friends. But yeah, it's always really fun getting to catch up and meet up in the States. So that's great. So I got to hit the hay. Uh, it's been a long day. Tomorrow's gonna be another long day. So I'll see you later. I'm, I really hope this was enjoyable for you guys. I had fun making it. So I'll see you in the next vlog. Good night, everybody.